Turn with me in your Bibles to the Gospel of John, the 12th chapter and the 32nd verse. Jesus said, And I, if I be lifted up from the earth, will draw all men unto me. Now Jesus here is speaking of the crucifixion. He's speaking of when he would be put upon a cross and die in the sinner's place. The Bible says that Christ was the just, dying for the unjust, that he might bring us to God. The scripture says he became sin for us who knew no sin, that we might become the righteousness of God in him. That is, Christ took all of our sins, everything that we've done that is wrong, everything that is unrighteous, he took that all upon himself. Every time we got broke God's law, Jesus Christ was punished in our place there at Calvary. And when he was there, he died in our place that he might give us his righteousness. He hath made him to be sin who knew no sin, that we might become the righteousness of God in him. But notice it says that, that he would draw all men unto himself. The gospel may be foolishness to people. Oftentimes, people, if they reject the gospel, they say, oh no, that's just foolishness that Jesus died for us. But nevertheless, the Spirit bears witness to the gospel and teaches every man that Jesus Christ is the Son of God, that he died in the sinner's place, and that a person can be cleansed of their sins. Jesus said, this is my blood which is shed for many for the remission of sins. The Bible says the life of the flesh is in the blood. Jesus shed his blood. Without shedding a blood is no remission. And then notice it says, If I be lifted up from the earth will draw all men unto me. We can lift Christ up just in our daily lives by preaching the gospel, by singing to ourselves and with others hymns and spiritual songs, by proclaiming uh, the scriptures, we can lift up the Lord Jesus Christ. And then when we do this, men are drawn to the Lord Jesus. They're drawn to Christ who can give them salvation. The Bible says that the scripture is able to make us wise unto salvation. So if you have never repented of your sins and put your trust in the Lord Jesus Christ, I would hope and pray that you would do that and that you would pass from death unto life and out of darkness into light. Thank you very much for listening, and have a wonderful day.